Good morning, everyone. It is Friday, April 14th, 2023, and it is time for your end of the week reading. So let's get over to the other table and let's get started. All right. So today I'm going to be pulling an oracle card from the Messages from the Spirits of Nature Oracle in in recognition of this beautiful spring weather that we've been having. Um, I'm also going to be pulling a tarot card from the Modern Way Tarot, and I'm going to be pulling a high vibration, raise your vibration card from the Kyle Gray Raise Your Vibration Oracle deck. So the Oracle card, again, will be coming from the Message of the Spirits of Nature Oracle. So let me get these shuffled, and as I do, I'm going to ask the angels to protect us. I'm going to ask the spirits of the land in my home to surround us, and I'm going to be asking the ancestors to give us wisdom. What do we need to know for the weekend, spirit? What do you want us to focus on? Please and thank you so much. I love you, spirit team, so much. All right. Oh, my goodness. All right. So our oracle card of the day is the eagle vision. Try not to get too much uh, glare on there. Eagle vision. All right, so let's pull our tarot card from the Modern Way Tarot, which is what I'm going to be using today and on Sunday for our weekly reading. So let's get these shuffled. And let's get some clarification on Eagle Vision. Shuffled here. Clarification on Eagle Vision, please, Spirit. And that Eagle Vision is card 13, if anybody wants to know. All right, the card that flew out is the Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles. All right, so let's take a look at this. All right, so when I look at the Queen of Pentacles, the first thing I think of is a woman who's made it. Like a woman who has worked really hard um, and gotten to the top, you know, gotten to the top of her of her field um, or is an excellent crafter or you know just a woman of excellence who has worked very hard to get where she got she nothing got handed to her she worked really really hard but in doing that in reaching her goals and getting to the top she was also very very generous um, and kind and giving to others who deserved it when she saw potential in other people, she would she would offer what she had to them to help them further their uh, endeavors as well. So when I see these two cards together, Eagle Vision and the Queen of Pentacles, I am feeling here like what we need to do is we need to broaden our perspective. Okay. You know, step back and broaden our perspective and look at what's available to us right now and see where it is in life where we can use our gifts to be generous, to be kind, to help others further their endeavors as well. Um, through the law of attraction, when you, when you do that, when you give generously from the heart, you get that back too, right? But we don't want to be singly focused on one thing. We want to take a broad perspective and really look and see and, and um, spend some time thinking about how our gifts can, can better affect people and what is the best way to do that. Um, and then do it. And then do it. And when you do things like that, when you do things, things come back to you. It totally is the law of attraction. Okay. So that's what I'm getting today from these two cards. But let's pull a high vibe card here. You know what, I'm going to pull the one, what's on the bottom? On the bottom we have, I trust the wisdom within. I 
I trust the wisdom within. And I have to say that I trust the wisdom within too. And I hope that you guys do as well. You know, we've all been through a lot in life and we all have so much wisdom and information and knowledge that we can glean from our experiences in life, but also from our ancestors. You know, one of the reasons why I do so much ancestor work is because I am trying very hard to pull that wisdom out from the ages, you know, um, and then pass that on to you guys and pass it on and use it in my own life too, you know. So trust the wisdom within. There's so much in you. You've already got what you need. You already got what you need. You know, that's the cool thing. That's like when you when that you have that aha moment and you realize that it's just like, you know. So yes, trust the wisdom within. So that let's go back to the other camera. So that is my short little reading for today, you guys. I love you guys. I hope you have a great weekend. I will see you all again on Sunday for our weekly reading. So take care, everybody. All right. Bye-bye. TGIF to you guys.